the board, it's all those gorgeous women who used to embody the spirit of Dolce Gabbana. That's the kind of thing that we were looking at. We're just all about that, the passionate face. Nobody knew that Sicily was made for fashion until Dolce & Gabbana came along a quarter of a century ago. With their latest collection, they've gone back to their roots, and we're happy to go with them. We talk about Sicily, but it's a Latin. There is something remind you of uh, Argentina, Spain, South America. It brought me back to the 80s when I would do these shows with all the lace and all that Sicilian emphasis on the woman. Just the Dolce Gabbana that I remember. Why is Inside Out so big right now? People want to go down to decor elements and symbolic when you go down to your underpinnings. A lot of net. Which is classic you as well. So it reminds you something from beginning but it's totally new. The proportion, the stitching, the fabric is new. So they went back to their own story and they pick up uh, the most beautiful pieces that they did in these years. And in this way, it becomes even stronger because you know exactly that you are Dolce Gabbana, you know? It's, no one else could do something like that. So I love all the handbags and the shoes and, you know, I think touches that make it newer, but reinterpreting the old in a way. Look at it. Yeah. Crochet. Sicily never looked this good, though. <laughs> There was a fresher cut to the dresses. It's just a little bit of um, tailoring that took it to this new look. Really makes it look modern. They say central, but it's also molto sexy, isn't it? Mucho, mucho, mucho. <laughs> straw, straw. Yeah, it's a new corset. Under every outfit, there is the famous body. We become famous with this outfit. <laughs> Did you find out new things about Sicily? Did you find out you know, your feelings about it had evolved in some way? It's not one outfit. The Sicily is one mood. It's a passion. You know, from the passion, it burns everything.